Today I'm going to talk you through how to program a Hunter controller. We're only going to do the simple programming. So first of all you need to insert the batteries. It takes six AA batteries. So the first thing we're going to do is set the date and the time. So you flip the dial to date and time and select the current year by pressing the up or the down. Push the right hand arrow and then you can select the month and the date. And the right hand arrow again takes you to the time. You can have AM, PM or 24 hour. Push the right hand arrow and then adjust the hour. Once the date and the time is set, we're going to go to our initial start times. So this is the time you want your irrigation system to turn on. Uh, you can have up to four start times set per day and four start times set per program. And then if you want a second start time, say in the afternoon, you can also set that. That's one for five in the morning and one for four in the afternoon. Once you've set your start times, you're going to select your run times. Each number represents a valve. So on this one, we have six valves. So we can adjust six run times for each start time. So I want my first valve to come on for 15 minutes. And just scroll through by pressing the right hand arrow to program each individual valve for the amount of time you wish the irrigation to be on for. If you don't want a valve to come on, um, then you simply just leave it at zero and it will bypass that valve. So once you set your run times, you can adjust the watering days. As you can see, you've got Monday to Sunday on there. So if you don't want the system to work over the weekend, you can just scroll through the days and then press minus on the day that you don't want the system to run. That's done, that's your basic timing set. So you flick the system to run and you're good to go.